Hello well, guys, really quick video today, um, since we've had a uh, bash on the uh, slots online, sadly we didn't make a withdrawal on the 32 red video we put out, um, I think we're as far, as far away from making a withdrawal as you ever could be, um, if you did sign up to a casino, um, whether it be through my link or um, directly with a any casino, um, when you come to uh, withdraw some funds, um, some of them even at the start um, of the process uh, will immediately ask you to verify your identity. Um, so what we're going to be talking about today uh, briefly is the KYC check. So what is KYC? Um, so KYC is stands for Know Your Customer. Um, KYC checks have been around for years and years and years and years, but they've gotten more stringent um, over particularly the last couple of years. Um, definitely. Um, it used to be a case that you, you wouldn't get asked that often um, going back sort of five, six, seven years ago. Um, but they do like to. Um, well, it's not that they like to. <laughs> it's probably more of a case that it's uh, required by the terms of their license uh, to ensure that um, the identity of their, their players is known. Um, there were some. Fines dished out by the uh, UKGC um, not so long ago um, because uh, diligent KYC checks hadn't been done. Uh, someone was stealing from their employer. Still, million, I think it's either high six figures or seven, uh, low seven figures um, stolen from their employer. Um, there's no due diligence done by the casino where the money was being deposited um, and, and they were fined. Um, because of that. Um, it's essentially about money laundering um, and just verifying your identity. Um, so what you need to know uh, as part of the terms and conditions when you sign up to Casino, um, you agree that you're not less than 18 years old um, of a legal age to gamble um, or participate in gambling activities in the uh, country or jurisdiction that you're within. Um, now, all transactions made by players on a website um, will be subject to be checked uh, to prevent money laundering and any other illegal activity. Now, for those of you that don't know what money laundering is, um, it's a process of taking dirty money, um, which has been gamed. Um, so, say if you steal someone's payment details, uh, you deposit. You deposit onto a casino and then you withdraw it onto a different payment method uh, to then make that money clean and in your account that is money laundering. Um, I work in the financial services industry so we do know quite, quite a lot about money laundering. We have to uh, do quite a lot of stringent checks and whatnot. Um, now you can see turn 5.5 the identity of the player will be verified upon withdrawal. Um, now my missus said the same thing last night, oh they're happy to take your money and um, what not, but then they're going to ask for paperwork and yeah they are. Um, if you if you submit a withdrawal request, live likelihood is the first time you, you will be asked to provide ID. Um, in ex certain circumstances, um, they may have to contact you and uh, ask further information. Um, about the uh, withdrawal request or the amount of money that you've deposited. It's something that's come in fairly recently is uh, source of wealth checks, um, which had got some people up in arms, but I, yeah, I completely appreciate um, the reason why that they're doing it. Um, for the, you know, the circumstance that I mentioned before, um, you know, someone in a what, 20, 30 grand a year job uh, depositing hundreds and hundreds of thousands uh, through online casinos, um, and the, the source of wealth not being checked, um, it, it's more of a responsibility point um, to make sure uh, that the person is not gambling more than they can afford to lose or putting themselves in serious harm. Um, watching a bandit video the other day, um, and he said that Grovesner uh, called him, um, or I think, I can't remember if they called or emailed him um, when he'd done some pretty big deposits there, just to obviously make sure it's normal, it's okay, it wasn't anything untowards. Um, 
there's a more of a responsible gambling culture than ever uh, in the industry, specifically among good casinos. Now, with the KYC checks, um, they'll typically ask you to provide um, photo ID, or two types of ID, um, one with a photo on it, uh, one with a uh, address on it. So that could be a passport, a driving license, um, they're probably the easiest ones. I know there's sort of like national identity cards and stuff like that. Um, a passport or driving license is the easiest one. Make sure if you do use a driving license, you have got it correct and up to date. Um, you'll also need to uh, provide a uh, like proof of address, um, such as a council tax bill, um, bank statement. It's really nice. It's so simple. If you pop into your local bank, they can just print your first page of statement. Um, just for you to take a photo of and scan it and send it in. Um, it, it really doesn't have to be as you know hard and boring as it sounds. Um, it just takes a couple of minutes to email it over. Um, they can on occasion ask for proof that you are a card holder, um, which is by taking a photo of the uh, front of the card. Uh, sometimes they'll ask for the back as well, but they don't do that too often. Um, but front of the back. And uh, you can go in and manually, um, before you send it over to them, they'll ask you. They won't accept it uh, if you don't uh, black out um, certain numbers. Because, um, obviously, for data protection purposes, they need to uh, do that. But they'll always make it clear on the email that they send you um, whether or not they uh, will require that. Um, now, obviously, if you're not able to confirm these things, and they can suspend your account, um, they can block all deposits withdrawals until such a time as um, it is that, that you have confirmed your identity. Um, with the source of wealth checks as well, um, they can ask for uh, proof of um, your income, such as like a payslip um, or sort of bank statement showing you know, the money being put into your account. Um, so, you know, it's just another thing to consider. Um, if you are going to be doing big deposits, they, they may well be asking you where the money is coming from. Um, and j just to be prepared, uh, the point of these videos is that you are prepared um, prior to playing um, and that you know exactly what's going to happen and nothing's going to be a surprise. Um, as always, make sure you read the terms and conditions. Um, your account can be closed and winnings can be voided uh, if you're not able to sort of prove your identity. Um, that's why it's so important, you know, you, you don't want to go and have a great session and a massive hit, make a withdrawal and not be able to get the cash out because you can't prove that it's you. So play safe guys. Uh, as always, um, links to my website uh, is in the uh, description below. Uh, please like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment on the video if you've got any questions, uh, if you've got any comments or if you uh, want to share a story um, about this sort of thing with me, please do so. Uh, if you want to join me over at Spinnet Casino, my uh, link is in the description below. It's also on my website as well, uh, along with all of the terms and condition uh, details there. Um, please, uh, if you if you do um, sign up through my link, please don't only gamble what you can afford to lose. Um, don't gamble irresponsibly. Um, if you need any help, there's uh, some support links um, on my website as well and in the video description. Uh, for help with problem gambling, such as GamCare, Be Gamble Aware, GamStop, etc. Uh, if you do sign up through my link, I really appreciate it. Uh, it does help me to uh, be able to provide further content on this channel and hopefully in the future uh, improve the quality of the videos as well. Um, hope you have a good day. Thanks for watching. Just wanted to come back really, really briefly um, just to mention um, I've got a new video um, coming out. Um, probably be coming out tomorrow or the next day, um, which is a uh, taking on the uh, first deposit um, over at Sky Vegas. Um, uh, it's already been recorded, I know what the outcome is. Um, my god is it a roller coaster, so you're going to want to uh, hang around for that. So click subscribe and the bell button and that will uh, give you a notification when that is released. Um, got another exciting one in the pipeline. Um, just going to wait to get a few more details on that one um, before I uh, bring it to you guys. Um, and hopefully we can smash that one as well. Thanks for watching.